workout. We're going to be working with four cardio exercises and four core exercises. Our timing format is going to be 60 seconds on for our cardio exercise, 60 seconds on for our core exercise, and then we're going to get 30 seconds of rest for that's going to be our first round. So then our second round is going to be 45, 45, third round is going to be 30 and 30, and then our last two rounds are going to be all cardio and all core for our Tabata. So let's run through the exercises we have to do today. So we're going to be starting with a lunge jump switch. That's going to bring our heart rate up to start while you're nice and strong. We're going to start in a nice lunge position here. We're going to drag through our arms, drag through our heel, and come up and switch. Big jump and switch. We want to make sure that core stays tight and that you're using your quads here. So we're going to jump that one down right onto our backs. We're going to be going into our core exercise. It's going to be a figure eight. So the shoulder blades going to go down, low back's going to go down, and your feet are going to hover. We're going to be making a shape just like a figure eight that's turned to its side. So it's like an infinity sign here. We're going to lower the heels down, reach it over. Lower the heels down and reach up, right? So for that other view, we're making that infinity sign here in the air, coming down and around, down and around to challenge that core. Then we're gonna move on to your next two exercises. We're gonna be doing a kettlebell swing. So you can grab any dumbbell you have that's a little bit heavier, or you can load up a bag, hold it by the handles, anything you can hold for a little bit of weight that you know you have a real good grip on so that it doesn't go flying. Hinging at the hips, we're gonna bring it back and drive forward. Come back, drive forward. So we're starting out with our kettlebell swing and then that core exercise we move into immediately after is gonna be a high plank Spider-Man. So hands are gonna be down, tailbone tucks under, you're gonna bring your knee all the way into your elbow and reach out. All the way to the elbow, reach out for that allotted time. Right, 60 seconds, moving to 45, 30, 20, and 20. Our next up, we're gonna go for a high knee run with a hand tap. So you're gonna bring your knees up nice and high. We're gonna go for a nice run, and you're gonna hit your hands. All right, we're gonna make sure that the same hand hits the knee, and the knees come up so high that you get that contact. And that's gonna move us right down into a high boat, low boat. So that core exercise that comes immediately after the cardio is going to be shins up towards the ceiling, tailbone tucks under, slide down with the fingertips to the knees, and then slide back up to the ankle bones. Slide down, core stays tight, and back up, tuck the tailbone so those abs can really squeeze. Your last two exercises here, your cardio exercise, we're going to be doing an invisible jump rope. So if you have a jump rope, Make sure you have it with you. It'll be on the required, the optional equipment that you'll need for today. You don't need a jump rope. You can just use your hands in a nice jump rope position, jump through the feet, and move the arms, right? This small jump is gonna be enough to bring your heart rate up. Every 10 seconds, we're gonna throw in two jacks, and then you're coming back to that jump rope. 10 seconds, two jacks, so on and so forth. Then your last core exercise here, we're gonna be doing a low plank reach. So it's much like a three point plank, but we're gonna be alternating sides. You're gonna be here with the forearms down, core stays tight in your perfect plank position. Then we're gonna reach one arm, reach the other arm, reach up and reach up. Make sure the hips don't shift around and you keep your abs squeezed in super tight, right? I like to exhale every breath and just really squeezing the abs tight so that you can reach without falling down and rotating. So those are your eight exercises and you have your time format. Once we get through all that, you guys will be done. I hope you enjoy the workout.